People read and watch and listen to true crime because it restores order from chaos. It's the comfort of watching everything put in its place after an episode of outright sickening bedlam. My name is Billy Jensen. I'm an investigative journalist and victim's advocate. I solve cold cases. Chase Darkness with me is my journey from being a true crime journalist who's written stories about unsolved murders, stories with no endings, and becoming so fed up that I wanted to solve these murders myself, and I came up with a system on how to do it. There are still are plenty of unanswered questions, and there's a lot of murders that are unsolved, and that's where I want the listener to join with me and try and solve them. As a journalist focusing on cold cases, I open letters every day from family members desperate for justice. Because everyone else had stopped listening, they came to me. I tried to help each and every one of them. But every story I wrote, they all had one thing in common. There was no ending. The killers had gotten away. The missing stayed missing. And now, as I stared at my computer screen, the man in the green hoodie was the newest face in the club. I watched the video again and again, my anger building with each play. After the 10th viewing, I made up my mind. This time was going to be different. I was going to give Marcus Gaines' story an ending. I was going to solve the crime myself. At the end of the day, there's 200,000 unsolved murders in America right now. Somebody listening to this book is gonna have information about at least one of them. It's the law of averages. It's not one guy killing 200,000 people. I want people to go in, listen to this book and say, you know what, I think I could do this. This guy's giving me a roadmap and then I want people to take the, the concept in the book that citizens can actually solve crimes and go in a million different directions. Just as long as you follow the code, don't interfere, but you can help. And the police departments need help. They're all underfunded. And if you ask any police department, why do you have all these unsolved murders? The first thing they will say is, we don't have the resources. They'll always say that. So why not use civilians? I wanna look into the ones that don't make the headlines that aren't as flashy or as sexy because they're still people and their story still needs an ending. And that's what I'm trying to give them every time that I try and solve a case. Mm -hmm.